Hi, today I want to review a book called Agape Love by Sir John Templeton. The full title is Agape Love, a tradition found in eight world religions. Um, so that pretty much summarizes what the book is about. Um, and if you don't know what agape love is, it's defined in the book as unlimited, pure, unconditional, altruistic love given for its own sake without expecting anything in return. Um, today is the day after elections, and I think a lot of people need to practice agape love because um, there's just so much division and disagreement uh, politically. So this book talks about eight different religions, uh, Judaism, Christianity, Islam, Hinduism, Buddhism, Taoism, Confucianism, and Native American spirituality. And um, there's a chapter on each religion. Um, this book is really pretty thin, pretty small. Um, it's about, let's see, it's 101 pages. Um, and the, you can see the book is small. So it's actually very quick to read. I read it in one afternoon. Um, but, you know, he talks about each religion and how they teach agape love. Um, and it was interesting because it's the same concept uh, taught eight different ways. Um, and each way is valid, each way is um, certainly has benefits. Um, but I found myself gravitating towards certain, certain religions like uh, Buddhism. I thought the way they taught agape love was interesting because they look at it from um, the perspective of suffering. And um, or they call it dukkha or suffering. Um, and they say um, that the Four Noble Truths lie at the foundation of Buddhist belief that suffering exists, there's a cause of suffering, suffering can be stopped, and there's a way, the Noble Eightfold Path, to stop suffering. Um, so they looked at agape love um, from the point of suffering and ending suffering. Um, the nice thing about this book also is that on the left side of the page, there's like a quote from somebody famous or from a religious text, um, which kind of underscores what the religion is trying to teach about agape love. Um, definitely an interesting little read, a quick read, um, if you're interested in um, altruism or, you know, just being a more caring, more loving person, you might want to read this. I give it five stars out of five. Uh, nice, quick little read. Interesting. It was heartwarming. Made me feel good to read it. Um, so yeah, pick up a copy or go to your library and uh, check it out. Let me know what you think in the comments.